right guys what's up welcome back to another borderlands 3 video and in this borderlands 3 video what we are going to be doing today uh we're going to be playing around with uh, a lot of hyperion weapons on our boy flak so i don't really know i'm going to title this probably like hyperion flak question mark or some shit but uh, i can tell you how this is going to work and what we're going to be doing um we're going to be going through the game with a bunch of Hyperion shotguns, right? So, we have uh, this uh, this reflux, times 14, next team mags radiation. Awesome, we'd love to see it. We have this uh, this powerhouse reflux, <laughs> uh, with next team mag shock, uh, with uh, only being a times seven. This one's a times 14. I love times 14's refluxes. Then I'm bringing a convergence for the lulls. Uh, pretty fucking awesome shotgun. Uh, radiation consecutive kits, which is what I like on, uh, on a convergence. Uh, and then we have our reflux here, uh, with time seven, this being consecutive fits. I'll tell you right now, this is probably going to be the one we use the least. So, yeah. Uh, now, I just, uh, now realized that I spec a new hidden machine, and that's totally irrelevant with a setup like this where we're, uh, we're using racks. So, uh, I'm actually, am going to respec out of hidden machine and probably just throw that into overclock. Uh, unfortunately, I do like in machine, but you know, when we're running racks, there's literally no point to using in a machine. Uh, but like, that's okay, that's okay. Uh, we're gonna be using uh, this plus ultra for an ability and incinerary, and this one for bonus cryo. Uh, and then our rack pack with a plus five and a grim harvest with shotgun and Hyperion crit damage and actual skill damage. Perfect, I love to see it. Uh, and then our pearl here with mag size and weapon re uh, reload, which is very solid, especially for uh, some of our times 14s that we have. Well, we only have one times 14, but still really useful. Probably use this one the most throughout the video, just saying. Uh, let me actually, I'll literally respec right here, uh, right now, and run. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So, obviously, uh, we're not going to use hidden machines, so we'll just actually go ahead and grab all of the overclock. Uh, which sucks, dude, because, like, Hidden Machine has, like, really been growing on me. Like, dead ass. Three is a sweet spot in second intention, in my opinion. Uh, obviously, we're using shotguns, so there's no way we're going to spec into uh, Two Fang. There's just no reason to. We'll max out Hunter's Eye, and then I know I actually put two into here. And then I'll just throw the other one into... We'll start into uh, YouTube Press, and then we'll go ahead and select our racks. Faulkner's Feast and Flack and Lotus, that's, that's the way I like to roll. And then, yeah. So, I, well, here's our setup. <laughs> you just watch me respect into it on camera because, you know, we don't have Hidden Machine. Or because we don't have Fade Away, so Hidden Machine's kind of irrelevant. But, yeah. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and head over to the Guardian Takedown. Uh, cook up some enemies over there. And then, yeah. So, I'll see y'all over there. Alright, so now that we're at the Guardian Takedown... Uh, we probably will shred these mobs pretty pretty swell here. I mean the reflux is like part demigod because like it's like literally insanely broken as I down myself, but But no look anyone knows uh, how much like anyway if you've been following the channel for like I don't know at least two three months probably know how much I love the fucking reflux dude It's by far uh, one of my favorite shotguns in the game especially for mobbing because you know it's literally just a better brainstormer and I'm pretty sure a lot of us were fans of the Brainstormer uh, back in like Mayhem 3 and Mayhem 4 before we uh, got the Mayhem 10 update with the Reflux. And that's all the Reflux really is, man. It's literally just a better version of the Brainstormer, just more damage. So, you know, there's really no reason for us not to play around with it. We even made a build, um, like I think it was back in July, before uh, Reflux caught a nerf. And, and a buff, because they, they buffed it after they nerfed it. And fucking goofballs. <laughs> but no, it was... It was like literally, bro. It was I, I can't remember. I, oh yeah, I called it rack flux, bro. Cause literally, I just used two refluxes and I, uh, yeah, I used two. Yeah, that's it. I just used two refluxes and that was all I needed to, uh, to, 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 to dick on the entire game. What is that? Like, literally, all we needed was two refluxes, dude, and we were able to like beat the guardian takedown and everything else in the game. I did that, like, just to show, like, yo, dude, the reflux is this cracked out. Like, it's that. It's one of those guns. Like, it's that strong. And, uh, yeah. To say the least, it, uh, kind of is, uh, was insane. Especially back then, dude. Like, the reflux was, like, such a, it was one of the few guns in the game. Uh, that could, like, actually really hold its own and pre-patched, uh, Guardian Takedown. Which, obviously, was the toughest piece of content that the game has ever seen. 
obviously guardian takedown is still like the hardest piece of content but it's a little bit easier uh way easier now actually since we don't have to worry about uh, the enemies being as tanky now they're still tanky but they're just not that tanky that absurdly tanky for no reason other than to be like just hard <laughs> you know what i'm saying but yeah dude okay so now we are uh, going to go ahead cut over and uh, to like the first part of the crystal phase i'm actually i'm not going to do the crystals uh we've done the crystals uh, plenty of times with this gun now uh, we're literally just going to go over there and we're just going to shred some of the uh, enemies and then we're going to head to the malamon takedown and then we're going to head to the slaughter shaft boys so yeah i'm going to head over to the crystal fa uh, crystal area and i'll see y'all over there all right now that we're over here i suppose i could actually pull out the shock one However, the times 14 uh, radiation one that we have right now is just so goddamn pretty. It's just so good, man. It's just so good. Plus, those extra pellets on this, you know, are really helpful. Like, just a little bit. <laughs> Although, I mean, the radiation does kind of chew through the shock. Like, dude, back then, bro, pre-patch guardian takedown, you had to match your ACs, bro. You had to. You had no choice. You, you, you just have to, bro crazy how difficult this stuff was back then yeah i want to use a convergence at some point in this video bro i want to give it some love rather than just a reflux the entire time but like bro who doesn't like to see a reflux in action yeah sit down homie you're not built for it you're not built for it you think you're built for it you're not because uh reflux Re fucking flux all right homie be like that okay we're gonna clean off uh, all of these enemies then we're gonna head to the malawan takedown and uh, it's gonna be great actually dude okay here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna use my convergence here it is and we're gonna take out some of the uh tougher ads Oh man, the convergence is still a really good gun, dude. This gun's really good. This convergence, you could argue that the uh, reflexes might be better. The reflex is definitely way better for mobbing, uh, obviously. All right, dude, we clapped their cheeks. Let's go ahead and head over to the Malawan takedown. Okay, so now that we're at the Malawan takedown, I am gonna use the time seven shock one. Uh, I do want to give this gun a little bit of love. I, I don't want to just literally uh, milk uh, the times 14 radiation one. I do want to show off the the times seven reflux. You know, the times seven is still a complete complete chank chank tank. Jesus, dude, English is hard. Don't judge me. <laughs> no, but seriously though, dude, the times seven reflux is still a complete pimp. Um, I've just been so conditioned to using that times 14 uh, for about the past, I'd say at least two to three months now. When the Guardian Takedown come out, it's like the it was June 11th. So yeah, wow, damn, three months already. Yeah, so about three months because, especially whenever, the, <laughs> once I get once once again, do whenever that Takedown first came out, bro, it just felt like it was it was so more more beefy. Okay, so uh, I think I have a actually, dude, we're gonna take this one off. We're gonna put on this one, and we're gonna go take out the Kraken with it. All right, let's go. Uh, let's, ooh, man, all right, let's go take out the Kraken with this convergence. Look at that beautiful damage. Oh yes, sir, baby. I don't even care that I went down. That was beautiful. Just use my reflex to pick my happy ass back up. Look at that easy work. Gotta love the Mega Bar procs, baby. Gotta love those Mega Bar procs, huh? All right, let's go ahead and head over to the Valks. You know what I'm saying? Yo, so like, an, uh, obviously a really good gun to like throw in here. Uh, would definitely be a face puncher, right? Now, uh, I don't really have any good uh, white elephants or coros or like stone artifacts, so I'm just you know still using a pearl and not a single uh, face puncher on this build. But like that would totally work. I'm just pointing that out. All right, so now that we're at the bridge part, uh, we should be able to run through this bridge part like as fat, like like legitimately ridiculously fast, dude. We got the reflux, so I mean, bruh, like this is what this gun does best. Fuck shit up, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, bro? All right, I still feel like we may have gone a little. Uh, we've nah, fuck it, dude. We're, we'll switch over to the time seven one. Get the time seven one some love, baby. 
the time 7 one doesn't have the radiation this one has the uh, next to max shock and then remember guys we're not running any radiation uh, ases or shock ases we're running cryo and cr incinerary i almost said corrosive that would have been real stupid <laughs> no we're running cryo and incinerary uh, ases uh that way each of our reflexes have four elements uh which is a hell to the yeah brother and uh, that'll also help our good old convergence as well. So, you love to see it. You love to see it. You love to see it. Where are the other enemies at, dog? <laughs> they're all dead. <laughs> That's where they're at. They're all dead. Hey, man. Have you seen your buddies? Hey, have you seen... Have you seen your buddies? I just want to know if you've seen your pals, man. You should uh, totally tell them to come out, man. We just want to have... We're, we're trying to have a good time. I murder all of them. Yo, in all seriousness, no though, bro. Where, where's the other enemies at, bro? I'm trying to get them all to spawn because I'm trying to get, I'm trying to run through this fast. You know what I'm saying? Got things to do, got videos to make, games to watch. It's football Sunday, bro, and I have to go to work. <laughs> no, but seriously, no, like, come on, come on. There we go. Let's get some more enemies out here, boys. Come here, boy. Man, dude, this convergence is putting in work, too. Like, I'm just, like, low-key. I'm like, damn. I think it's, like, kind of insane. Just kind of. Just kind of, though. You know what I'm saying? Just kind of. I'm gonna reload that. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna look around. I'm gonna look over. I'm gonna shoot you. Where's your friends? I'm trying to, trying to see you. Trying to, you know what I'm saying? Where's your enemies? There's literally only three enemies. What is this? Yeah, okay, there you go. There's the enemies I'm looking for. There we go. Yeah, spawn them out. Bring them all out. Bring they sorry asses all out because they're all going downtown. I'm talking six feet underground, baby. All right, open that door. Open that fucking door. <laughs> Yo, what is this? All right, I'm just going to skip, uh, skip over to Wotan, you guys. Right, Wotan. You're dead. You're dead. You're done. You're freaking done, mate. You're so done. You have no idea how done you are. Now I know you're going to jump. It's all good. You're going to spawn your robots. And then we're going to fuck you up and your little robot friends up immediately. Don't jump on my five head. It's mine. My head. It's not your head, it's mine. Bitch. <laughs> now I'm gonna use the convergence, bro, to do some massive single target damage. Screw the dead or half. You're done, son. You're done, son. No, 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 no. <laughs> you know, hit your uh, hit your buddy over there. Hands on your knees, hands on your knees. He's stunned. He's stunned. He's stunned. He can't move. He's screwed. I oh shit. <laughs> Wotan, you screwed the pooch there, buddy. <laughs> buddy. <laughs> All right. Now we're gonna head over to the slaughter shaft for like a round or two, bro. And that will be the video, bro. We're just fucking up the entire game. With nothing but Hyperion shotguns. You love to see it. So yeah, I'll see y'all in just a bit. And now we've arrived at the good old fashioned slaughter shaft. So now well we won't be here too long. This is just a nice little area we're gonna wrap up the video. Sometimes the slaughter shaft is pretty good, you know, because these are you know pretty tanky, uh pretty tanky enemies. I think if anything, the slaughter shaft enemies are more annoying than anything because they spawn with those lot off rocket launchers that can like two shot you. With, you know, their mayhem scaling. Because, you know, that's a thing. <laughs> oh, man. But, yeah, dude. Uh, I feel like this is just a good area to come in here and show uh, show off uh, the pure destruction that their uh, Hyperion flat can make. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you love to see it. You do love to see it. Mega bar is so good, dude. You gotta love that mega bar, man. You just, you got to. It's like next to impossible not to love re the, uh, the reflex, yeah. 
the reflux and for sure Mega War, dude. Every flag player loves Mega War. So, yeah. Complete, dude. Literally, <laughs> fuck it. The reflex is just so goddamn good, dude. And then we just whip out the convergence to instantly drop the single target enemies, bro. Everybody wins. Everybody wins here, dude. And then we obviously we use the reflux for the mobbing search uh, situations, bro. And like, bro, everything just wins. This is just it just works. Everything just works with the setup. Reflux is broken as it always is, man. We have four different elements this thing's doing, bro. Cryo incinerary, uh, corrosive, and radiation. Isn't it's just beautiful, dude? I want all. We want all the elements, bro. All of them. Now our convergence says they are both consent kits, so they do not. Uh, they do not uh, have four elements. Just uh, keep that in mind. All right, dude, that was round one, and I think that's what we're going to just about call the video, guys. I hope y'all did enjoy the video. Uh, real quick, let's go ahead and, and uh, showcase off uh, our setup. Yeah, we switched off that. We didn't even use that consecutive uh, hits times seven uh, reflux like I thought we would. But, yeah, the, the consecutive hits are definitely way, way amazing uh, on the convergences. And I just like the next two uh, mags 100% with the reflexes uh, ever since. Ever since the Guardian takedown, I just love using this, these a lot more, uh, more than the consecutive hits on them. But you know, consecutive hits will still wreck the game. Anyways, um, here is once again our Pulse Ultra, our Cryo Hunter Seeker, our beautiful Pearl. It's amazing, and then our Rack Pack with Hyperion Crit, Shotgun Damage, Axe Skill Damage. You love to see it. You love to see it with five Enogram Harvest. You love to see it. And then here is our Hunter Tree. You know, ten Enogram Harvest. Well, itself, you already know. Uh, and then here is our stalker tree. No hidden machine because you know we're on fade, uh, fade away. We're on uh, racks. So, yup. And then we got uh, we just put through uh, persistence hunter. But yeah. Anyways, guys, hope y'all did enjoy the video. If y'all did enjoy the video, make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new, guys. We are on the road to 5,000 subscribers. Trying to hit that by the end of the year, so you know what I'm saying? If you like Daily Borderlands 3, then you should totally subscribe. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that being said, my name's Cree, and we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.